Hello YouTube. It might be it might be a little loud for you, but my sound really isn't working well, so I had to plug in a mic and stuff so you can hear what I'm gonna say. If you didn't read the top part, this is a review of the three DS. Yes. Now the first thing you're probably gonna ask is, does it work? And that answer is yes, it really does work. It's quite amazing with it, but like, one problem with it is if somebody's looking over your shoulder, they won't be able to see see the 3D. It'll be just like blurry to them. You gotta be like looking right on top of it. So, you might be disappointed with that, but overall, it's really good with the 3D. Um, and another thing with the 3D is, is that it's not popping out like it's like looking into it yeah like um if you're playing pilot wings with or um you'll see like the um landing spot and like the clouds you'll see like one like next to your plane and one far away and you can like tell how far they are apart and um the can it's very much like the DSi, except no DSi shop yet. It's going to be available on the eShop. But the camera, the reason that there's two cameras is that um, the two cameras make it 3D with your eyes. Well, not your yeah. Well, your eyes. It makes it 3D, and then there, and then there's one on the inside. So yeah, that's pretty much all about that. And then the stylus is adjustable. Oh, look at this. Look. It's amazing. I don't know why they did that. I think they just wanted to. The, the pin's on a new spot. It's not on the side like it usually is on top of the system yeah one thing about the 3ds that's new is the um um is the cradle that comes with it and um it's pretty much a thing that holds your ds you can play with it but it's kind of awkward with the shoulder buttons because it's harder to press it so yeah about that then on the inside, you'll see that the um, there's a new thing, like the home button, start button, select button. Then the power button's on the opposite side. And then D-pad on the bottom, and then slide thing, majiggy. That's what I'm going to call it. Alright, I don't know the true name, but it um, moves your character for 3DS games, and it's really useful. And then there's the 3D death slider on the top screen. Probably won't be able to see that, but yeah. They changed the volume again. Like, they changed it to back to the side. They changed it to the side, and it's a slide thing again. Because, like, on the 3DS, you know, not, not the DSi, that um, you had to, like, press the, the button a few times to get like to maximum volume well you, you can just like slide it now and it, the 3ds comes with an SD card and then headphone jack power button power on thing and then light thing that means when it's charging and then on the back is the pen and the charging thing and the game I got, I don't know what game I got in there right now. Mm -hmm. Clubhouse games. That's why I got in there. So, yeah. For the three, I did get a game with the 3DS. Rayman 3D. I was a new person to the series and I did not know what I was going to expect of it. And the game is about collecting fairies and stuff. So I was a little bit confused about that. 
So yeah, if you're a Rayman fan, if you're a Rayman fan, you probably want to get that. Um, it's okay. It's repetitive after a while. So, um, one thing that I dislike about the system right now that's going to come soon is the eShop. It isn't on there yet, which I'm really mad about because I got like all the po the points that you need to um, put on the eShop, and you it's not coming until another update. I'm not sure if the update has come yet, but I'll check that later, and then I'll um I'll like do do an update video to this, so I'll like talk about the eShop. The 3DS is literally a portable Wii. It has Miis, which work pretty well. You can take a picture of yourself, and it transforms it into a me, which is pretty neat, I think. So that's a new thing. And then um. There's street paths, which I haven't used much, and I'll talk more about in the updated video. Crap!